I, uh, I'll tell you something. I, uh, I decided I'm going to get a tattoo. I decided I'm going to get a tattoo. You know that? Did you know that? I decided I'm going to get a tattoo. I'm going to get a tattoo, and uh, um, I want to get a classy tattoo, though. See, I already have one tattoo, but I decided uh, I'm getting older. I still want to get one, but I don't want to make a mistake. I don't want to get a tattoo I'm going to regret. So I decided I'm going to get a classy one. Uh, I'm going to get a bow tie on my neck. Because yeah. <laughs> number one, it'll match my suspender tattoo that I already have. <laughs> and uh, after sex, I'll get to do this. <laughs> get out. <laughs> I don't know now. Uh, what I'm trying to make is this. Uh, I read something today that I found very, very disturbing. Um, I uh, read a sentence, and I hate to bring you down, but I read a sentence in the newspaper today. And... Sentence read, in the time it takes you to finish reading this sentence, 20 people will have died of hunger. And I find that very upsetting and disturbing. Because how the hell do they know how fast I can read? <laughs> I had to read it again. I killed 40 fucking people today, everybody. <laughs> I told you about the fresh fruit company I worked at, eh? Did I tell you that? I used to work at the fresh fruit company. I also, uh... Holy <laughs> smokes. Sorry. Okay. Uh, I'll tell you this. Another job I had, I used to work, uh, it was tree planter. I don't know if anyone here is tree plant. Uh, oh, come on. No way. That happens. <laughs> sir. Uh, excuse me, sir? Huh? What are you doing? Why are you? Me? Are you reading a book? Uh, it's a magazine. What the fuck? He's reading a fucking magazine in this show. My mom can't shut up. This guy's reading a fucking magazine. What's going on here? Yeah, well, can you put it down? It's got to be pretty fucking entertaining. You come to a show, and you're supposed to watch, and now you're reading a fucking book? Uh, I'm almost finished. No, you're not. Don't fucking read the book. Put it down. Put it down. Oh, you know what? If it's that fucking entertaining, why don't you bring the book up here on stage and read it to all these people if it's that fucking entertaining? Yeah. No, you know what? Yeah, come on. Get up here and read the fucking book. It's that entertaining. God, what is going on tonight, man? Is there a full moon outside? This is crazy, Steven. Put a cock on the cookie already. Do you know what I mean? This is crazy. No, seriously. Yeah, get up here. What's your name? Steve. Steve, get the fuck up here. What's so entertaining? You think it's so good? Get up to the microphone and read it. That's there, Steve. No, seriously. Why don't you read the book? You're so fucking entertaining. Read it. Just go ahead. I'm so disgusted with this show tonight. Disgusted. <laughs> Once in, he hammered me with his thunk pole, <laughs> bracing his hands against the white tiled wall. Wait, 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 wait. Go ahead. <laughs> His hard nipples and sweaty cock hair brushing against my back and butt nearly drove me to orgasm. Panting like a dog in heat, Brent whispered, let's trade places. I gladly obliged. It's getting hot in here. Play it cool, John. No need to get excited, just play it cool. Remove my throbbing meat from his well-stretched hole. Yikes! It's volcano hot in here. Fired my hefty load up Brent's hairy crafted back, covering his tanned skin. I fell against him limp, and we both gasped for air, exhausted and drained. Oh yeah, baby, squeeze it, milk it dry, he said recklessly, with the white chism on the shower floor. Get to, yeah, you know what? Thank you. Cool tattoo I was gonna. Thanks. Yeah, yeah. <laughs>